Hey guys, welcome to my channel Digital Dog. Today I have a beautiful piece in front of me, luxurious brand, uh, Mercedes A Class 2021. This is specifically A2220, and uh, as you can see, um, it has uh, different features, the futuristic features as well in this car. Uh, and uh, I will explain you uh, about the luxury brands ethos down to your small and affordable entry-level sedan is a tough task so uh, Bent uh, 2021 Mercedes-Benz A-Class which is specifically this one delivers a sophistication similar to its more expensive stable mates it also owns a spot on our e editor's choice list Mercedes equips all A-Class models with a host of luxury amenities and offers even more as optional extras a turbocharged 2.0 liter four cylinder engine is standard and delivers adequate power but easily fades into the background for quiet highway cruising. Tech features abound as well, including a version of Mercedes dual screen, infotainment, digital gate display, which I'll show you when I'll go inside the car, and which is set up with the MBUX infotainment interface. Going up against other compact luxury sedans such as the Cadillac CT4 and BMW 2 Series Grand Coupe puts an even finer point on the Mercedes luxury experience. So guys, uh, let's uh, talk about first of all the wheel. Uh, in addition to a new 18-inch uh, wheel design, 2021 A-Class gains standard blind spot monitoring and an optional gesture control feature for MBUX infotainment system. So let's talk about engine transmission and performance. You know what guys, 2021 A-Class, the sole engine choice is a turbocharged 2.0 liter four cylinder that generates 188 horsepower and 221 feet of torque. Front wheel drive is standard with A220, while A224 Matic adds all wheel drive. A seven speed dual clutch automatic transmission handles the gear shifts. A224 A Matic, we tested hustled from zero to 60 miles per hour in 6.1 seconds. That's a bit slower than A3 we tested, which made the sprint in 5.5 seconds when equipped with a top engine in the models lineup. So we noticed, guys, we noticed that front wheel drive um, A-class sedans travel with less impact harshness than the heavier all wheel drive model. So um, still steering is precise, throttle response is superb, and there's almost no turbo lag. So fuel economy is real world MPG. It estimates that 2021 Mercedes-Benz A220 will achieve fuel economy of 25 by 36 uh, MPG city highway. That's less fuel efficient than the Audi, but it gets better mileage than Acura with a A220 formatic mileage dips to 25 by 34 MPG. So with entry-level luxury models, the cabin design can sometimes be heavy on the entry-level and light on the luxury. That isn't the case with A-Class. So this sedan has an interior with a premium look that lives up to the Mercedes-Benz standards. As you can see here, let's start the engine first. So the interior with a premium look you can see there a trio of circular air vents adds this you can see they, they have added the one um, extra I mean not extra the third one uh, it adds decorative flair to the center stack and the cabin can be upgraded with upscale options just such as leather upholstery as you can see uh, heated front seats and LED interior lighting. Uh, it's all a uh, lighting system here. If you uh, go there and uh, you want to check the lighting, you can go to media, you can go to comfort ambient lighting here. So uh, I, I will show you all the lights and ambience uh, of this car at night time to you guys as well. So guys, as you can see, the front seat is really 
a memorable comfort for any passenger and that helps make the A-Class a great car for those who face long commutes. This is really, really, uh, I think, better for those people who has long commutes, one or two hours drives from office to work, and this is really, really comfort. So let's talk about safety as well. All the Mercedes Benz is the safest, safest vehicle in this world, but I need to tell you about the safety of the Mercedes 2021 A220. Uh, it hasn't been crash tested by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration. Though it's light on standard driver assistance features, a broad range of these amenities is offered and optional equipment. Key safety features also include standard automated emergency braking with pedestrian detection. And standard blind spot monitoring is there, of course, and available adaptive cruise control is also uh, available in this. So um, uh, if you're uh, more curious about the warranty and maintenance coverage, uh, it is merrily adequate when it comes to the scope of its warranty coverage. You'll get a longer powertrain warranty with rivals such as the Acura if you compare with the Acura vehicle. Limited warranty covers four years or 50,000 miles and powertrain warranty covers four years or 50,000 miles. No complimentary scheduled maintenance. So high class appearance, tall, taut handling, relatively spacious cabin and uh, yeah. I think uh, you guys uh, would have enjoyed all of the in interior and exterior of this vehicle. So uh, last but not the least, I'm going to tell you the pros and cons of this vehicle. Um, the pros is that the, is, this is the spacious cabin as you can see. Uh, all four passengers or five passengers can sit easily and comfortably in this car because the cabin is really spacious hot handling and high class appearance of course it's the luxurious class um, and the futuristic appearances as well you can see here and the con if you can come to the cons the spewny cargo area some competitors are quicker several mainstream compacts uh, offer more standard driver assistance tech This was it for uh, from um, uh, me uh, from my greatest uh, empire, the uh, digital dog channel, and uh, this uh, um, uh, car A A two hundred and twenty model is really really luxurious, but it is affordable. So if you are interested in this car, a kind of car, you can go to Mercedes Benz and uh, you will enjoy. Take care and goodbye.